What's happening, beautiful gamers? Blank here, and welcome back to another episode of Black Myth Wukong. I believe that over there is a tower where we actually did some fighting already, so we don't really have to worry about that. This place looks kinda dead. Got more enemies. It's kinda interesting how these little fellas are kinda like waiting for you to like show up, and behind you, you have the big boy. And they actually give you some rare materials too, which is actually pretty interesting. Anyways, just wanna wanted to point that out. There's not much going on right now, except for dealing with these guys. Oh boy, that thing was disgustingly close. But that's enough for me to be able to destroy that. Sit him down. Oh, if you trigger the... I, I, I think I always make the same mistake and... When you trigger the power, <laughs> when you trigger the power that you dodge or do something like that, it kind of like interrupts your actions, which is not cool. But hey, you know what? It's okay. By the way, just want to say welcome in, everybody. If you guys are new to the channel, if you guys are old, doesn't matter. Love y'all. And uh, thank you very much for all the love and support that you guys are always showing on this series. And I really appreciate the fact that you guys are deciding to watch me play in this game instead of watching somebody else. Because I promise you guys makes me feel really happy and it's really incredible whenever you guys do that. You guys are incredible. Alright, what else is going on in here? What else are we missing? Boss fight? Big bridge with a, with a guy standing in the middle? Yeah, it doesn't look like a boss fight at all. I mean, why would it look like a boss fight, right? I'm just, I'm just saying. I mean, you know what? It doesn't matter. Stop giving me the silk. I want the items to be able to craft the other armor. I'm just saying. <laughs> Please. Give me this. Is that... What is this? Nothing. Anyways. Hey, what's up, buddy? Cutscene? Where's my son? I can't... Oh, he's in this day! <laughs> yeah, whatever. What happens if I transform? Am I am I your son? Like, is this is this? Well, I mean, I'm a wolf right now, but I remember fighting a guy that looked like you. Goodbye. Is my karma? That was a little bit too easy, bro. Have what? Being here? All my skills, I failed. You did, and you actually failed miserably. What? Uh, this, this has to be another transformation, yeah? Okay. And then we got a key item. What is it that we got? Oh no, we got a new one of these guys. So Tiger's Acolyte. Sounds good. Increases critical damage. That could be pretty awesome to use. Transforms and just hits pretty fast. I might change to him. I, I do have to farm the money to be able to do that though. What is this? Can I use you? No. Examine. Child's play. Okay. And what is it? Through this rattled drum is someone warm and tattered. When shaken, it is still makes a lively... Um, okay. I did see something though. Wait. Is, is he... Oh no. That's not that. I did see something though. When we, we, when we were back, yep, um, there was like a um, this thing over here. No. Huh? You know, I thought that thing that had color was where I was gonna have to use the the drum because it has some like yellowish, not yellowish, but like whitish color. Okay. I mean, that's fine. We're gonna have to go through the whole map, running left and right, trying to figure out where to use that thing. However, something that we have discovered about this game is that every single item that needs to be used in this game, it's in the same area. 
Like, just because I got it in here, it doesn't mean that... Like, I got this item, yes. And it's gonna have to be using the yellow thingy. It doesn't... You don't have to go to another place or something. That's something that we have discovered throughout the whole adventure. Like, this game doesn't really, like... This game doesn't really, like, make you visit one area and then go to the other one. Except for the masks that you have to set, know what I'm saying? But it wasn't anything, like, crazy or something like that, so... Yeah, it, it's kind of cool. Oh, what is that? Ooh, curious. Is that another one of the concoctions? No, we don't have concoctions. Ooh, it's this? While perfect dodging recovers... Yes, that's good. It's really, really good. Cannot break that. Gotta heal up a little bit. And now I'm a little bit freaked out because I do have to discover where to do those things. Know what I'm saying? But we should be able to see because there is probably going to be like a sign in the map. Like it's always there's always a sign that says, oh, you can use this in here. So the game is kind of good at that. It's just that you have to be really close to the area to be able to do it. Just gonna have to like go around. If I cannot discover it, I might have to speak with my brother to see what's happening. But is this like a big boss fight type of area? Yeah, because I dropped down. There's no way back up. Am I gonna have, like, some sort of, like, sign? Oh, wait, isn't this where... What? That makes no sense. So we have the bridge. We have the wind formation. And then we have these three areas. This is a little bit strange. Couldn't be too difficult though, right? <coughs> oh, hello. I'm here, little monkey. Let me hear my rattle drum. Why is he talking to me like that? Where is my pa? Did you see him? I was scared. They were all around me. But they told me that the people from the village and fed them to a guy. That's a lie. It's not my part. Hello. Okay, so we're just gonna have to like as as any other quest. Just walk around and try to figure out where all of those things have to be triggered. Are you gonna say something else now that I defeated them? Okay. It's a little bit strange to like, I don't know, have to run around the whole map trying to figure out where that drum is. I haven't found anything to sober up the the, mo the, the, the the board though. Like that is one of the strange things that I'm encountering, you know what I'm saying? Like it is like, we are doing these type of things, but then the, the, the big board, we haven't found anything to like sober him up. I mean, I, 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 I do not know. Maybe... <laughs> I, I, I do not know. Can you kill? Yes, you can. No, no, you cannot. See what I mean? It's uh, The shield is so annoying. Like, they already have enough health and then the shield is like a pain in the day. Can we do that? Yeah, probably. Wait, did we ever do this? Enemies? Where is it? Oh shit! Oh, hello there. Where do I use it? Here? There I'm it is. here, little monkey. Let me hear my rattle drum. Yeah, 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 there it is. Oh, is that a chest? 
Oh, wait. I haven't opened that chest just yet. Oh. Thank you. Pa told me when the dust stops, my cough ends. Well, I mean, to be fair, if it is really dusty, it makes sense. Here. Don't frown like that. Our village is fun. Your village is fun. Piggy who steals all the drinks. And at the bottom of that well, that's a secret. Which well are you talking about? Right, you guys remember this area? This is where we killed the, the freaking earth that was kind of like annoying me. Nothing to worry about. Here it is. Where? Is that the well that he was talking about? That's a well. That's a well that he was talking about a second ago. Let's go. How did you even know I was here? Just Pa and I know of this place. Don't tell anyone, but I have a friend in this well. He helped me with my coughing fit. It's been so long. I hope his wounds have healed too. Uh, sure. Wait, I thought... Okay, whatever, you know what? You do you. Rotten mutt. And he dares bear our father's title under that yellow wing, why? Brother or not, I will have my vengeance. The kid's dad ran off, but now you've shown up to me! I'm sure, mad freaking tiger, I'll deal with you. Excellent. Oh my god, he can out! Wait, the hell? Is he the brother of the other tiger? Okay, you know what? I don't have many choices in here. He destroyed my fusion. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. He's not the my tiger. Oh, the fuck is happening right now? Sit down. Listen. Right now, you're doing way too much damage to me. How much more damage or how much more are you gonna do? I stop him. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's another one. Goodbye. We did it. We did it. He's dead. That's all that matters. Ha! Piece of shit. <laughs> Let's go. Ooh, yes. I am. I definitely will have to like farm some stuff. So <laughs> that's a lot of sparks that we have too. Five sparks. Pretty sick. Pretty sick. Let's open up this up. Nope, come on, come on. Let's go. Why we still don't have another trans... Oh, I think the transformation of the weapon to like the sword thingy is like a one-time thingy. Like, I think that's the only transformation that you get. If I gotta be honest. I don't think you get another one. Ooh. Ooh. What do you do? Health recovery is half, but attack is increased for a short duration after using the ground. Hmm? Each sleeping... Okay. Oh, but this is kind of like... Oh! Oh, but recovery is half. But then does that matter? 
When the ground's full, the first seed replenishes full health. That's actually good. I have to consider it. It's, it's definitely interesting and it's definitely not a bad thing. And that kid, why was your pa a mad tiger? Can I jump in here and then exit? Oh, the fuck? There was another one. Wait, are we still going at this? Like, where are we gonna go now? Like, can I progress through this area? Because it looks like you can. Can I drop? No, you cannot drop. Okay, so this whole area is like just, just creepy. Yeah, the area is just creepy. Okay. Okay. Just one last look, just in case there's something that we don't miss. Would have been also. Oh, that is that the well? Oh, that's actually no, there's no well. That's actually strange. I wish there would have been like a like a well hole. <laughs> Anyways. We might have to do some extra things, so let's go around. So I had to look for help to figure out this guy. It turns out that when we went to the village, we got the item to give it to him. So we should be good. Oh, how refreshing. You woke me up. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> Enough with the chit chat. My belly's growling. <laughs> sure. You got something else to say, boy? I must quench this rumbling in my belly first. The Temple of Crouching Tiger. They say there's meat there. Worth a look. Ooh, are we gonna find him the eating all the rotten first, crops? Then the toil. Hunger brings no spoils. Ugh. You should eat more, skinny. Off we go to the Temple of Crouching Tiger. Sure. You're gonna say that I again? I must quench the, the Temple of Crouching Tiger. Oh shit! The He's saying more stuff. Wait. Hunger is he repeating no himself? Spoils. I think he is. Uh, you should eat more, skinny. Right. So now he says to the temple of crouching tiger. So I guess that's the next place where we have to go. Interestingly enough, it's like, I mean, we had the item. Was kind of like weird. I was really confused. I thought it was gonna be something to suffer the guy, but turns out that we got the item when we went to the. How do you call that? When we went to the village. Like that section, the last one that we did in this episode, actually. So it all kind of like matches up. Know what I'm saying? So it's kind of awesome. Let's just do that. Get some incense. And let's go to that temple of Tiger. Crouchy Tiger Temple. Let's go. He's probably gonna be eating all of the corpses that we found. You guys remember? There were a bunch of corpses in the floor. This was the chest. You can actually move? Wait, no, we did that already. It's kind of strange that you can meditate multiple times. I wish you were... Hello there. I wish you were unable to, but that's fine. Oh, this putrid rat meat is insufferable. Huh. Help me score a tasty treat, will you? Sure. What do you want? That drives me mad. I've been craving a taste of that juicy jade lotus. Can you find me some in this barren land? We had some. Let's go. I wouldn't mind some meatless meals from time to time. Sure. Hmm. I have stumbled upon some interesting leads. The realm of gold does hold a connection to this desolate land. I hear the realm of gold is where the sun sets. There, they held rats above all others. Mm. And somehow, before we knew it, the realm was gone. Quite odd, that is. Mm. I just tried those rat guys. They taste like men flesh. Hmm. Its people are not yet extinct. I suspect the Yellow Wind Guai had a role in their downfall. Our senior brother gave me a piece of gold. I'll need it here when the time's right, he said. Hmm. It's the right time now. I'm taking it to the right place to give it a try. Hmm. I just tried those rat guys. Its people are not yet extinct. I suspect the Yellow Wind Guai had a role in their downfall. Our senior brother yeah. gave me a piece He's of He's repeating gold. himself. Sometimes it's... 
Sometimes they speak so much that I have a hard time to like understand what is it that we need to do. I think this guy is the last quest of this area, which is kind of interesting. I think by completing this quest, we would be finalizing every single quest in the chapter 2. Which is pretty awesome. I think that after this one, we would have, what, done every single quest in both chapter 1 and chapter 2. But then, we have every single other chapter upcoming, so this, this, this game is long. This guy. That the brother? My brother. Are you really strong enough to like fight me? Are you really? Oh, oh wait, did he have like lost? Oh wait, oh you have to like, have a good opportunity to summon. But I mean, if you're like your brother that is a drunk head, then you, you should be easy. Ouch. Beautiful. That's a lot of damage that we're dealing to this guy. Let's go. Ugh, what an excellent fight! The intensity! <laughs> this is good. You and I should explore that realm together. I... <laughs> Something that is impressive about this game is that everything has a purpose. Like, you really have to, like, you're really able to, like, find everything. Is that a better mask than the one that I have? A little bit more defense. The one that I have is cool. For a short duration, after using the grout, moderate increases attack. I want the peak face. Come on, are you gonna tell me we don't look fire? Well, I don't know how we look, but that's fine. It's so awesome. Like, we thought there was nothing to do in here, but look at that. There is things to do. This is impressive. It's just awesome. And these are the things that I tell you guys all the time. Like, whenever you guys are sure that I am not going to do something, you guys are more than welcome to spoil me in the comment section down below. Know what I'm saying? No problems with that. Same was with this. I actually was super done. And they were like, nah, nah, complete it. Come on, keep going. Men in our time do not see the ancient moon. But this moon hath shone on men of yore. Behold! Be it the realm of sunset or the realm of gold, it's but an echo of the past. Legends speak of an ancient, colossal beetle in these sands. Whilst deep in slumber, it lay hidden beneath the Earth's embrace. When awakened, it would devour all souls that crossed its path. Its shell, harder than stone, defied the strikes of common arms. It struck fear into traveling merchants and wider to neighboring realms. But a yellow-furred rat sensed the immense power emanating from the insect. He halted the beetle's havoc and harnessed it for his own ends. Overjoyed, the king named the rat Gwai, the royal sage, and built a shrine in his honor. The bound beetle was a perfect source of power, so the rat stayed. He seized the tongue monk using the new power, and battled with Soon Wukong upon the Yellow Wind Ridge. The Gwai's formidable wings veiled the vast expanse of the sky. Were it not for Bodhisattva Linji, tongue monk's quest for the scriptures would have failed. Yet, stripped of the rat's protection, the kingdom was plunged into a state of ruin. The once lush Yellow Wind Ridge now lies a desolate wasteland.
And I guess with that done and this beginning right here, so we're actually going to be wrapping things up for the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Much love to y'all and I'll see you guys in the next one.